I don't understand how in California, Los Angeles, West Hollywood, a serial killer on the streets and just nothing was done. Two African-American gay men took their last breaths in the West Hollywood home of a wealthy Democratic donor. Ed Buck is well known in West Hollywood battling City Hall for causes near and dear to his heart and spending big bucks on candidates who support his views. Jamel Moore and Timothy Dean both died of overdoses in Buck's West Hollywood apartment in the last couple years. The LA County Sheriff's Department says they have found no suspicious circumstances of foul play. My son did not OD, he was murdered. Ed Buck, he didn't care about Tim. He didn't care about Jamel. Jamil stated, I honestly don't know what to do. I become addicted to drugs and the worst one at that. Ed Buck is the one to thank. He gave me my first injection of crystal sick meth. Timothy explained a lot up here on the hill when we would hike about the temptation of all the money that Ed would offer just to go and get high with them. It's really men in power who get away with it. We're going to have a third one and a fourth one if we don't stop this man. A loud call for DA Jackie Lacey to prosecute Buck for murder. Do you think your political influence is keeping you a free man now, sir? Tim was a really special guy. And I really didn't get to see the 360 view of him until he passed. Jamil, we are his extended family, and we do want to make sure that this never happens again. Jamil and Timothy, we realize how many lives those two individuals touch. And had their life not been as precious as it was to so many people, we, we probably wouldn't be here. Thank you.